Yeah. Hi. Hi. Uh, busy day, so what's up? Uh, I was just wondering if we could talk about the Tracy cover. It's a hit. Yeah, I got asked to shoot the Oscar nominees next month in Los Angeles. So I hope you're feeling good because you were a big help. But what is it though? Because I'm bare today, so uh, I can't talk for long. The photo that they used, I'm sure you didn't do it on purpose, but I took that one. What are you talking about? When you stepped outside for a few minutes, um, I took a picture of Gemma. That's the one they ran. <laughs> um, Rooney, are you out of your mind? You, you, you weren't hired to take pictures. I'm quite certain of that. I took every photograph. I mean, I, I know you've been super supportive of me, but I just wanted to get the credit amended, you know? See if they could add my name to Are you on another planet? Okay, you were an assistant brought in to assist me. I don't know what's going on in your head, but every photo was taken by Zev Sikowski and was credited to Zev Sikowski. And I don't want to hear another word about it. Yeah, sure, I'm sorry. I must be remembering wrong. Look. I get it, okay? You're young, it's your first big shoot. You're gonna do amazing things, Rooney. Okay, but if you want your mentors to support you, you gotta support them first. Right. Okay. All right, like I said, I got a lot to do today, so uh, that'd be all. Oh, and Rooney, let's make sure no one hears about this. Okay, I don't want things to get unpleasant. Got it. So he just flat denied it? Yeah, I mean, he said that there was no possible way for that photo to be mine. You've gotta be kidding me. I don't know, Haven, maybe he's right. You know, that PR woman was really on me and the day was tense. And I mean, he's right. He is this big famous photographer and I am just a student. He's gaslighting you. I've seen your work. That photo has you written all over it. What am I supposed to do? Call up Gemma James? Call Tracy, you can be like, hey, my friend worked there in high school, help me. You're making it sound hopeless. Maybe it is hopeless. Maybe I just have to chalk up this whole experience as bad and move on. Rooney, if we're learning how to be artists, that means learning how to stand up for our work. You make it sound so simple, but he's our professor. And honestly, I do not have the mental capacity to deal with this right now. Look, I get it. And I'm sure all of the stuff with Birdie is super weird, but you can't let him get away with this. Trust me, it is not that I want to. Maybe I have to. Oh, that's coming along. You think so? Yeah. Yesterday it was more blob-like, and today I can almost tell it's a dog. <laughs> it's a tree. Oh, well, maybe by tomorrow I'll be able to see that. <sighs> what do you want to do for dinner tonight? I think there's some mac and cheese in the pantry. Mm, I love mac and cheese. But are you sure it's still okay that I'm staying at your place? Yes, and stop asking or I'm gonna change my mind. Okay. Hey, Bertie, long time no see. Oh, hi, Joy. Um, I don't mind you being here, as long as your fingers don't get sticky with my supplies. Look, I know you don't believe me, but I'm not a thief. I was only borrowing stuff to impress a guy. And. It turns out he wasn't worth it anyway. <laughs> Trust me, they never are. Where'd that come from? <laughs> it's pretty. Oh, um, it's mine. I started painting. It relaxes me. You're not half bad. Really? Chelsea thinks it looks like a dog. A dog in a tree, <laughs> I mean. I can't believe I'm saying this, but would you be open to painting a few things for the lounge? Seriously? Yeah, the owner gave me some extra money this month to buy a few things. Uh -huh. um, don't you want to ask like an art major or something? I'm more inclined to ask someone who works here. Works here? Yeah, we're short staff and need someone who knows what they're doing. And we miss you around here. Really? Yeah, thanks, Joy. You're welcome. Just make sure you prove to me you're worth the second chance. I will. Off to pay? No, actually, 
There's someone I need to talk to. Should I come back later? Hi, Birdie. Um, hi. You all right? Yeah, it's just this stupid thing with my professor. Well, do you want to talk about it? No, actually, I don't. Okay, um, well, I just wanted to clear the air. I know there's crazy emotion with Miles and him playing us. And the kiss. Yeah, that was unexpected. Uh, yeah, yeah, Sam, it was just heat of the moment. Uh, no big deal. You're cool, right? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. I'm cool. Cool. Well, I am very happy to have my bestie back. Because I have some really amazing news. What? You know Joy from the lounge? Yeah. She's buying one of my paintings. Pretty, that's amazing. I know, I know. <laughs> um, I'm celebrating later tonight at the lounge. You in? Honestly, I would love to. I, I really would. I just, I don't know if I feel up to it. But it, I, 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 look, hey, I, I look, it's, it's not you, OK? It's just this whole thing with Zev, and I kind of have some things I got to do, so. We'll, we'll talk about this later. Okay, well, have a good day. I have to say, in all my years of teaching, this class is one of my favorites. So since it's the last day, I just want to say, does anyone have any thoughts or questions? I have one. By all means. So everyone's been talking about your portrait of Gemma James. Congratulations, by the way. And I just wondered if you could just tell us a little bit more about what it was like, you know, getting that photo. Well, if, if I'm being honest, it was quite challenging. <laughs> quite challenging indeed. Uh, the lighting wasn't cooperating. Gemma was getting quite antsy. Mm -hmm. But as photographers, you know, Got to keep pushing through. It must have been really helpful having Rooney there. It was. Um, she was. Actually, I'm happy you brought that up, Haven. Sure thing's up. Since it's the last day, I have an announcement, some good news. I just got off the phone a couple hours ago with Gemma James, and she would like to have a student to be with her on set during the summer. She was going to be a lead in a new horror flick, something about Gen Z vampires or something. Wow. Wow is right, Haven. And she wants a student to follow her around and film her social media content. And there's only one student that came to mind. And that is you, Rooney. She remembered you from the shoot. She did? Of course. So I'd get to be with her all summer? Yep, in New York City. Room, board, travel, all paid for. It'll be a really good opportunity. <laughs> I mean, are you serious? Rooney. Um, can I? Do you think I could think about it? Um, I doubt Gemma is the type of person that wants to be kept waiting, so you have until the end of the day, or I'm sure any other student would relish the opportunity. But that is the end of semester, so thank you so much, you guys, and have a good summer. See you. He is buying your silence. You really think he's that scared of me? Gemma James was there. She saw you take the photo. He's obviously terrified. And now he's got some swank internship lined up for you to keep you quiet. I know, okay, I know you're right. I know I can only take selfies, but just for the record, I wouldn't mind spending a free summer in New York with a movie star. <laughs> uh, Kendall, you're not even in photography class. I know. Look, I know he stole your photo but he probably feels bad and that's why he's giving you the trip. Look, if Rooney takes this internship, she's telling Zev that it's okay to take credit for her work and it's not okay. Okay, but imagine what this would do for my career. Spending an entire summer with Gemma? Rooney, that is pathetic. Hey, I know it's easy for you to judge, but imagine getting this trip. Well, I would never get it because Zev would never choose me. Oh, okay, Haven. So what do you want me to do? Turn it down so you can have it? Is that what you want? You know that's not what I want. <clears throat> okay, you're right. I'm just confused, okay? I mean, if I confront him, I get nothing. But if I don't, then I live with this, yet I get this incredible career opportunity. It's like there's no good way out of this. Yeah, it's true. 
I didn't mean to sound so harsh before. Whatever you choose, I have your back. Me too. And I know you're just an assistant, but if you need an assistance assistant, I'm totally down to come to New York with you. <laughs> But it's worth, I hope we can be more We are a thousand words, that's our current score There's that picture we took that time Stole it from you and now it's mine I imagine this could happen but don't know how you feel Maybe yes I'm taking it. Oh, Rooney. Um, yeah, it's good to hear. New York could be a little impressive in the summer, but I'm pretty sure you'll figure out how to have a good time. I just wanted to let you know this doesn't make us even. What you did was wrong, and even if you won't admit it, you stole my photo. Seriously? Still on with this? I wanted to learn from you, and this isn't how I wanted to get ahead. I respected you. I seeked your approval, but now I understand your approval doesn't mean anything. Hmm. Pretty sure a lot of actresses would have to disagree with that. They don't know you're a liar, Zev. You know what, don't worry. I'm not gonna make a big deal about it, at least not now. I worked hard this semester, and I deserve a good summer, so that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Good. Travel the world, have a good time. You feel a lot better when you come back in the fall. Oh, I'm not gonna feel better, Zev. But you know what, that's not for me to live with. That's for you to live with. Look. Maybe you did help me out more than I thought. But you're gonna have a long career, so you should kinda move on from this. I'm gonna remember this. But not because I want revenge. The truth is, I don't care about you. I'm gonna remember this until I'm better than you. Until I'm the one they're calling. And I'm gonna forget you just like everyone else will. You're not my mentor, Zev. Rooney, geez. You have a good summer, Zev. I learned a lot from you. See my piece? Is that us? Maybe. Bertie, that's amazing! Thank you. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Girl, what ended up happening? Well... Um... Well... I'm going to New York. <laughs> Look, Zev sucks, but I'm not gonna let him get in the way of my dreams. And neither am I. My mom said I can stay with my cousins in Brooklyn, so I'm I'm coming with you. Are you serious? Yes. Well, if she's going, then I'm gonna go. <laughs> I always wanted to spend a summer in the city. Summer in the city! <laughs> I don't know what just happened, but you guys have fun in the big city. I got my job back. I'm gonna be working here all summer. Working sucks. It's not that bad. Summers in Provincetown are the best. Oh, I can't believe our freshman year's over. I know. Well, you could always drop out like Birdie did. Uh, hey. <laughs> I mean, she has a point. Birdie. All right, well. I'm gonna get back to work. Y'all let me know if you need anything. One second. Marty. Yeah? I'm sorry. I had a crazy day and honestly I was really distracted because I- Rooney, I can't stop thinking about you. Marty, I can't stop thinking about you. I should be dreaming all the time. I just stay dreaming. Nothing if I don't go make it something so surreal that's worth living it for.